How to factory reset the iPhone 14. Welcome to One Out of Smartphones tutorial videos. In this video, I'll be showing you guys how to do a factory reset or erase all content and settings, uh, removing all the information off of the device and getting it ready. Let's say if you're going to be selling it, giving it away, getting rid of it, trading it in, whatever. It just deletes all of your personal information off there, your photos, contacts, any apps, anything you have on there, it will remove them and get them back to the factory settings. So uh, the, what you're going to want to do is start off by going into settings. But before that, you might want to back up any information, anything you want to keep. You want to back it up to your iTunes, iCloud, whatever you use to back up your information. Back it up and then do this reset so you don't lose all that information. So once you got all the backing up done, you're going to start off by going into settings. Once you're in settings, go ahead, go into general. Once you are in general, scroll down to the bottom. You will see a um, transfer or reset iPhone. So right here, there's an option for reset. Uh, that's not what we're looking for. Erase all content and settings. That is what we are after. Once we select that. Um, here it says erase this iPhone. Erasing will remove your personal data so this iPhone can be safely traded in or given away. Uh, the following items uh, will safely will be safely removed from this iPhone. Um, apps and data, whatever I have on there. And all you got to do, if you're backing out, hit not now. If you're going forward with it, hit continue. And it's asking, are you sure you want to erase all media, content, and settings? This cannot be undone. Um, so anything that you're going to do, you will not be able to get back unless you backed it up and you got it transferred to, say, another device or you got it backed up to iCloud, iTunes, something like that. So um, I just had a few photos on here. Uh, there was nothing too wild, nothing um, that I was saving or anything like that. So right now it's just doing the reset, clearing all the information off there. We got a little Apple uh, screen loading. Um, if you have more data, more info stuff on there, uh, it will take a little bit longer to get this fully reset, fully cleared. Um, if you have Apple um, iTunes signed in or your iCloud account, your Apple account signed in, it will ask for the password to fully reset it to clear it. So just keep that in mind. Um, you can sign out of it even before doing this factory reset. That would also help. So uh, this will take a little bit. Let's just go through this process. I will start this up as a new device uh, with no info on it just to get it back up to the home screen so you guys can see the full process of this reset. Just like that, um, it finished that loading that bar with the Apple. Uh, once it popped up, boom, it took me right here to this uh, hello screen, the welcome screen. So right here, starting off going English in the United States, uh, set up manually. Uh, it's asking, going to be asking for my Wi-Fi. I'm just going to go ahead, type that in. And now that the uh, password is typed in, I'm just going to go ahead, hit join. Um, it should connect to my wireless network, to my Wi-Fi, and activate or start up that way. So the previous screen said it may take a few minutes to activate your device. Um, I'm not activating it to align. It's just kind of going through the steps, connects it, and it continues it. So here's a da um, data and privacy. I'm going to go ahead and hit continue. It's face ID. I'll set up later. Passcode, uh, passcode options. I'm going to hit do not use passcode. It's asking me, are you sure you don't want to use passcode? Don't use passcode. I can set that up later. Um, and here it's asking if you wanted to transfer anything, uh, restore from iCloud backup from Mac or PC. Transfer directly from a different iPhone, move data to Android, um, from Android, don't transfer apps and data. So I got nothing to move, going to hit nothing, um, forgot password or uh, don't have Apple ID, I'll select that, set up later in settings, going to go ahead and not use the Apple ID now. Terms and conditions, go ahead and agree to those, um, keep your iPhone up to date, continue, iMessage not now, disable location services, you sure you don't want to use them, yes, I hit OK. Um, set up cellular. I'm going to set that up later in settings. I'm just going to go ahead, set up your eSIM. I'm going to be skipping that. I'm not activating this device at the moment. Uh, Siri, set that up later in settings. Screen time, set that up later. Analytics, don't share. Light or dark, it doesn't really matter. Hit continue. Standard or zoomed. I'm going to go with the standard one. Uh, emergency SOS, little info on that. And then welcome to iPhone. And just like that, a couple of these last bits and pieces. Um, set up cellular, I'm gonna hit not now, are uh, setting up now, loading up different uh, apps, getting everything loaded. So there you guys have it. That is my quick reboot, just info that uh, you kind of have to go through to pretty much show you guys nothing is on here. I didn't add any of my info. And I would, if I were trading this phone in, I would send it in just like this with nothing on there. It's connected to my Wi-Fi, but big deal. They can kind of figure that out there as long as you don't have your I, uh, iCloud signed in. So there you guys have it. Uh, my my way of doing the factory reset. 
erasing all content and data from the iPhone 14 and 14 series phones. Hope you guys found this video helpful. If you did, be sure to give it a thumbs up. If you know anybody who may be looking for this information, please do share it with them. And that's all I got for you guys in this one. Thanks for watching. Have a good day.